Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the Moon Pay app. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Alright, so you've gone ahead and downloaded and installed your Moon Pay app on your mobile device. From here, we want to go ahead and open it up. And then you'd be taken to this page here where it says Moon Pay Trader All with Moon Pay. So click on Get Started. And now we need to go ahead and create a new account or sign in. So depending if you use Moon Cap, Moon Pay again, just simply sign in or sign in with Google. I've signed in and created my account with Google. So I'm going to use my Gmail account here. So now this is going to sign me up and sign me in at the same time. So it says setting up my account. From here, you're going to be taken to the home page inside of Moon Pay. You can see that's my profile at the top here. You can allow notifications or maybe later. I'm going to do maybe not later. All right, so once you're here, we need to start to make some deposits so we can buy some crypto. So from here, it's going to say $0. So now let's go ahead and put in some money. So click on the deposit button here. And it'll say deposit. Fund your trades by topping up your balance. So we can top up our account here from using um, receive from another wallet. So your address is full support. It's uh, down below. So we can copy any one of these addresses and send crypto directly from like say your Phantom Wallet, Metamask, Binance or whatever cryptocurrency exchange or platform you're using. And then once you've done that, it's going to come up here and it'll say your total value. From here, we can go ahead and buy crypto. So you click on the buy button and then you can search for whatever crypto coin you'd like to purchase. We can also under here, it's got discover more. We can see what's trending the volume, market cap, etc. All by using these tabs here, new, top gainers. So yeah, they've got a whole different range. And also we can change the time. So we can change it from five minutes, one hour, four hours, 12 hours, one day intervals. So you can see the one day or the 12 hour rather price movement. So everything's going up by the looks of it. And now once we go back to the home page here, we can look at our wallets. So you can see what's inside of here. So click on the wallets and you'll be able to see what cryptos you're holding and their price value. And you can also click on view external wallets if you like by clicking onto that. So what external wallets basically are, it's other wallets that you've interacted with before. So they're going to appear here. Now if we want to cl click on the gear icon and change our profile picture, we can do so by clicking on the pencil. And we've got preferences, so we can click in the preferences and we can change the currency if you like, the theme and notifications. If you need to log out, you can log out here. And if you need to delete your account, click on account and you can go ahead and delete your account there as well. And that also going to show you your customer ID inside your account. 